Once the plugin is installed, you can set up new campaigns. But for this example, I'll just show you the badass guns campaign that we already have set up here. So if we click edit and open it up, we can see that this campaign name is badass guns and it's working for this Facebook page ID, which is this Facebook page here that we set up a few days ago. You can see that we can specify up to three keywords related to our fan page. And once we have those three keywords installed, we can get a load of really great data on all Facebook pages related to those keywords. So you can see here that for all of these different Facebook pages, we can see how many likes they currently have and all these columns are sortable so we could sort by likes to find out the current most popular page. We also have a talking about metric here and talking about measures engagement. So searching by this means we can find the most engaged fan page right now related to our keywords. We also have two different heat values here and heat is a measurement of the increase in likes or the increase in talking about over the previous day. So we can see that, for example, this National Association for Gun Rights page has an increase of 3,472 likes in the previous day. And we've got the little icons here. So if we search, um, if we sort this column by likes heat, we can see that anything with a little flame next to it is a really hot page right now. And um, it's had a really big increase in likes over the previous 24 hours. And we can do the same with the talking about heat. That's the increase in the engagement over the previous 24 hours. And we can see that anything with a little speech bubble next to it has a really large increase in engagement over the previous 24 hours. So the idea here is that we've given you a load of really powerful tools and techniques here to find pages that you can auto engage with using the plugin. And to start engaging with any of these pages, all we need to do is flip this engage switch from off to on. And you can in sort, again, these columns are all sortable, so we can sort by engagement here to see that these are all the pages we're currently auto-engaging with. Um, you can open up any of these pages at any time. And we can see here, look, there's an example of a post made by this page, and there's an automated comment made by the plugin. If we head back to the plugin, we can also see that as well as flipping these engagement switches from off to on, we can also bulk engage with multiple fan pages at the same time by just using the bulk start engage or stop engage action here. And if we go to the log tab here, we can also see a complete list of all engagement actions taken by the plugin. So we can see all the comments, likes, replies, etc. All the engagement done by the plugin is listed here. We can see the time it went out. We can see the comment made. And we can also see exactly which post the plugin has engaged with. So if I open this up, we can see that on this post, the plugin has posted this comment here. And we can also see if we scroll down a bit that the plugin has automatically at random liked some of these comments so we can see here that we've liked this comment here and we can also see that the plugin has even done an fully automated reply to that comment so 24 hours a day seven days a week the plugin is going on to other fan pages in your niche fan pages that already have a super high engaged audience and it's engaging with those fans for you, giving great exposure for your fan page and generating real hyper interested, hyper engaged fans to your page. Now I'm just going to quickly jump back over to the plugin and show you exactly how this engagement works. We have two tabs, we have comments and replies and they come with a load of default spin tax comments that you can use right off the bat. So as soon as you install the plugin, these are just generic comments that will work for any fan page. 
and you can add your own or you can delete them you can fully customize this we've even got a little tutorial on spin tax there so if you don't know how to use spin tax that's there the same thing for replies we've got highly highly spun replies and these will all automatically go to these hot hot pages that you've identified and that your market is engaging with and using these spun comments and these spun replies the plugin will automatically engage with the fans and drive them to your fan page. How effective is this? Well, let me show you. If we go back to our guns page that I showed you earlier, we just set this page up a few days ago and already we've got 722 likes. If we scroll down a bit, look at some of the engagement we're getting here, 296 post reach of this post that I just posted 20 hours ago got four comments we've got well 21 likes there scroll down a bit further 356 people reached for all these different comments all real fans engaging with our content here we got 471 reach we got shares we got likes again more comments here we've reached 675 people and if we just scroll down it just keeps on going on and on 754 people here if I go on to the insights page here, dig into the data a bit, I'll show you just how amazing this is. So from the 7th of July to today's date on the 18th, we've gone from zero to 723 page likes. We can see that all of these page likes are organic. We haven't done any paid advertising whatsoever. All of it is completely organic. So we haven't been buying any Facebook ads, haven't been doing any of these promote page buttons where we have to spend money to get likes. This is all 100% automated, 100% free fans that we are generating. If we go and have a look at some of the posts and I'll just order this by engagement. We can see, look, just some of the post reach we're getting here. We're getting 700, 600, 700, 700. So our posts are reaching nearly all of our fans. Imagine if you had a mailing list that you had nearly 100% open rate on. That's what we're getting with this because these fans are just so interested and so engaged with our content. You can see that all of these posts are getting